Hi all, Sika Sue here. I'm going to take a topic today that both hurts me and uh, need to get rid of in my system. Because I've said for a long time that the lies are going to start to reveal themselves. And that is starting to happening now. One by one, they are coming through. One by one, they are showing themselves. One by one, I get to know things that has been lied about so much. And uh, I've always said that the skyline of 666 floors that was built upon me, it's going to break down sometime. It's going to be taken down one by one floor and um, it starts to happen but I also realized after a call I had tonight that it is time that I really start to tell my story if you ever if you are in or if you've been in or if you like me grown up in a narcissistic environment take some time and think Take some time and start to realize what is important to you. I have realized so hard this journey that it is one thing. And today when the lies start to reveal itself, I really understood how very important this last year have been. The journey to start to love me for who I am, what I am, but also realizing that nobody ever known me. And um, I still get sad when I get those lines thrown in my face. But I'm not angry any longer. And I'm just shaking my head. And I just realize that you more people don't want to know me, it's okay. Let them, let them don't. And the more I hear lies that are built today, I just laugh because I know so well it is untrue. And I can look around where I live, when I am out, how people smile when they see me, how people get happy when they see me. But I can also say thank you to those people who have been for me this year. I've said so many times, you need to find tools for surviving. Tools that you can take in days when it's bad. When you get to know things that hurts your heart so much. I had one of those tonight. It wasn't just one lie, it was at least ten of them. But it needed to be said. And also I needed to know because I can't work with what I don't know. But when they're coming to you, you need to take them and you need to filter them. Otherwise you're not going to survive. If you have problems like alcohol or drugs or doing things like that to numb your CTPSD or something. Stop it. It's not worth it. It isn't your fault that the narcissists are with you. It's not your fault that people are lying about you. The only thing you can do is turn your back and walk away. Stop taking those energies. Stop being there for those energies. I still have one energy that is lingering somewhere in behind. Uh, an energy I can't take away. Yeah, it hurts. It does hurt. And I know you're watching this. It does hurt. Because all those lies, all those untruths you didn't tell me. It wasn't nice. But I realize one thing. My be quiet over who you are. It's not okay. It's not okay. And I'm not going to be quiet any longer about anything. Not my ex-husband, not the woman who stole my things, not the attorney who was supposed to help me, who didn't help me. 
But I also not going to be quiet about those three that I love the most. Because I love them so much. And I even not going to be quiet about my ex-husband any longer. It's not worth it. My story is my story. And if I'm going to be there for people, I need to tell my story. I need to be there and I need to to show people that it is a tomorrow. No matter what, you have to believe in yourself. You have to go through what you believe in. The picture you see behind me, it is a house in Florida that I've dreamed for so many times to live in. One day I'm going to live there. I'm going to be there. I'm going to be at that lake, you see. I know it so well. But if I'm going to come there, I need to believe in the future. I need to do the future. And I need so strongly to shut out the energies that is not worth it. So if you are one of those people I mentioned, and you keep lying about me, go ahead. Because I'm not going to care. Go ahead. I'm going to laugh every time I hear something like that. Because you can't take me any longer. I know who you are. And I know exactly what you did to me. But you know one thing. If I'm going to let that eat me. I wouldn't be the woman I am. I wouldn't have that strength I have. But mostly. Giving is living. And I wouldn't be able to give and help other people. And serve other people. If I would let you eat up me. So go ahead, keep lying, keep doing everything of those. And if you have, if you are anyone from that hellhole who have been lying for me so many years, I really don't give a care. Because you see, one day they're going to turn 18. And that day, their mother is going to be there. Just the same thing that their mother is there. Every time they reach out for me, today. Because you see, the only thing that matters is that your lies is your lies. And they, they're going to keep being your lies. But if you never want to see the truth, it is your business, not mine. I'm going to shut out all those energies. And I'm going to keep working for what I'm believing in. But I also want to say a thank you. To those beautiful people on the other street of my home where I'm living. You know who you are. Without you and your good energies and every kind words and every moment of time you give me. You are incredible. And I do love you so much, every one of you. I wouldn't be where I am today if you haven't done what you have done this year. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. Now, I'm going to let you all go. If you haven't subscribed or if you haven't liked, please do so. It helps me to be more visible in the YouTube universe. And uh, I need that because I'm going to do this. But also, I can't give if I'm not visible. I can't be there for all of you who need it if I am not allowed to. So, I do what I always do. I keep going no matter what. And... Um, even if I'm not going to care about the lies, I keep still hearing them. And um, if you don't have better things to do than lie about me, go ahead. If you can't live your life the way you want to do, I really don't care. I care about the people who want to have my help, who want to have my words, who want to believe in the future to come to their own dreams. Behind me, I have my dreams. And I'm going to be ending up there. And I'm also going to be ending up with the one thing I dream about the most. Security, freedom, and somebody to love who loves me back, right back the way I dream of. And I know that it is somewhere out there who's going to do that someday. So... I wish you all the best. I wish you everything good you can have. And uh, 
See you soon again. Bye-bye for now.